Hello and welcome back to whoops, okay, there we go. Um welcome back <coughs> to the Toss Principle. And that was just number four? Yeah, that was number four, and so wait, did I collect all the pieces? Yep. Let's go to number five. Bam. It's been about a few weeks. One or two. Or maybe three. I don't know, I can't really remember. Why does everything look like? Oh, there we go. Everything looks like crap. I'm like, what? Arisa Seven. Tell me of the fearsome demons of Duat. The dying man said once to the scribe, to the white scribe. Though their terrible forms are loathsome to behold, they are not evil. For they are the servants of the gods. Truly, they are blessed doorkeepers and guardians of the holy paths. Their charge is to judge whether we are worthy to pass the gates that lead to Aru, and they challenge us with riddles or in combat. Is this the true? Is this true of all beings that live in the in Dua, the Duat? Some say that it is not so; that there are ancient gods whose names have been forgotten, and spirits of the darkness whose names name na, name none have ever known and that these must be avoided at all costs. But others say that these two serve a greater purpose in ways that Arius Osiris has not revealed to us. And what of the hidden paths that are taken by blah, 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 when the blah, blah. <coughs> Coming soon to a theater near you. From Rob McKeon, Institute of Applied Nomadics. To mom, coming soon, your son in 3D. Hi, mom. I promise I'll be home soon, maybe in a couple of weeks. I know, I know. But what we're doing here is important, and the team needs my help. I'm not going to wait until it's too late, I promise. But there's much, so much that we have to set up. So much that has to work for a very, very long time. <laughs> Besides, I always wanted to work on one of these supercomputers, and believe me, EL is pretty much the best there is. And the team, Mom, is like, I'm working with rock stars and mad geniuses, except nobody's heard of them outside of the science journals, of course. But Dad would totally be geeking out if he knew. Maybe I can tell him about it soon, huh? Love, Rob. Blog 42, or 24, or something, whatever. What is the point of being alive? I know, I know. It's an old question, and not one that's easy to answer. But I mean, if you're reading this, you are alive. And someday you will stop being alive. Both of these facts are incontrovertible. So what about it, then? Don't you wonder? Don't, do you just want to go from not existing to existing to not existing again without even considering why you right now as you sit there reading this why do you exist what is that purpose of your life do you have one should you have one is it better to have a purpose or not when you approach death you will feel that your life had meaning will you feel that your life had meaning if so why if not why not? What defines whether a life was good or not? It may seem abstract right now, but the, at the, but that moment, just before death will come, it is inevitable. If you don't ask yourself these questions, how will you face that moment? Well, it's time to go on to the puzzles. <coughs> is this a puzzle? What's this? It's like a sign. Broken sign. I guess this isn't, isn't a puzzle. But it looks like an area for a puzzle. <coughs> a broken and lost puzzle. Slightly elevated sea gel. Sigil. Um,
Let's just try to connect this thingy with everything that we can. <coughs> and this one. And then we'll put it on here. Oh, I didn't notice before, but if it shows which ones it'll connect to by highlighting them. I didn't know that. <coughs> and now that one's up there. And there we go. Well, I got all the green pieces. <coughs> that one's backwards. Or that's going back. <coughs> all these red pieces. Whoa, there's something here. Strange. My myself in our two jammers. Damn. I'll just keep on staying here. La de do do da. Well, that sounds about good enough. Huh. <coughs> I'm gonna have to think for a minute. Or two, or a few more. And then I'll put this actual jammer pointing at that so that it won't shoot me and then I can go over to that side. But uh, where's the other jammer? So it has we have two jammers, me and my two jammers. So where's the other one? I don't see it. Oh, it's probably because it's not actually actual. <coughs> I think I can figure this out because I, at one point, I did point it at that. There we go. Now I can go over here. And then he'll point it at over here instead. And then I point it at that one. And then I'm through. Ha ha ha. Figure it out easily.
have a bad cough. No, now it's time to go to this one. <laughs> the four chambers of flying. Oh, there's a star up there. <coughs> Womp, 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 climb, climb, climb. <coughs> ah, can't do it. Can't cheat the system. <coughs> Let's collect this one. Doo -doo. That one, and then we do this one, and then we put it right, right here, <coughs> and then oh wow, it didn't get flung very far. Well, that doesn't seem to be the answer, so... Um, oops. Ugh, I have a cough. Da -da -da. Um, well, hmm. Well, let's see what else is over here. <coughs> Well, I think I throw the cube over here. <coughs> and the cube went over there. Good stuff. There we go. <coughs> Still have to figure this shit out. <coughs> 